Give it up for Chad Rizzler! We need, like, Depends for drivers, right? I realize, like, most of the Floridians are already wearing Depends. But for the under-88 crowd, which is only, like, seven of us, apparently, the entire state of shopping around Publix, you see somebody that's under 80 years old, you just kind of wave at each other. You're sitting in there, you gotta go, and you gotta size up your options. You're like, am I really gonna piss in this Chipotle cup that's been <laughs> sitting in my center console for a week and a half? Still has a little bit of iced tea in the bottom of the cup, which is about to become an Arnold Palmer. <laughs> yes, I am. And if you haven't peed in your car before, not as easy as it sounds, because first off, those cups fill up a hell of a lot faster when you're holding them at an angle. <laughs> than when you're pushing them under that uh, soda dispenser. But we need Depends for drivers. You just can't call them that, nobody would buy it. Too much stigma. So I think we'd have to call it like roadies, right? <laughs> they could be like biodegradable, eco-friendly, gluten-safe, dolphin-free, vegan, non-GMO. <laughs> It'd just be like this round sponge with a showerproof mitten, waterproof mitten on the back of it, right? That way you just shove the thing down your pants, you do your business, you roll the window down, and it's not littering if it's biodegradable. It's like a banana peel, right? And then you just fling that sucker out the window, it bounces off the windshield of the Buick Century behind you. He spins out, he causes an accident, he makes 50,000 people live an hour. It's a cycle of driving in Florida, guys. It's, oh, yeah.